Good morning, everyone. Thank you for tuning in today. I'm Jenna Stauffer. This morning, I'll be talking with local artist Ray Rolston. I'll also be speaking with certified wellness coach Heidi Go Lightly. But first, I want to focus on election season. This obviously is a critical time for our state right now. But with the right leadership, we can rebuild and start turning things around. So with that being said, I'm joined first this morning by state representative candidate Morgan McPherson. Morgan, thank you for being with me this morning. Oh, thanks for inviting me, Jenna. I really appreciate it. No problem. Okay, Morgan, before we get into your campaign and why you're running for state representative, could you just tell our viewers a little bit about your background? Sure. Um, my mother is one of 13 children that grew up in the city of Key West. Crazy. Yeah, her <laughs> father back in the day um, was in charge of um, the school system's buildings. They used to have two superintendents. They used to have a superintendent of education mm -hmm. and then a superintendent of maintenance and construction. Mm -hmm. So my grandfather, her father, um, grew up working on buildings and part of the educational system for years. Like I said, she was one of 13 and um, she's the only one that actually still lives in the city of Key West. Wow, wow. And that's something. She got a full scholarship to University of New Mexico where she met my father within six months. They got married mm -hmm. and uh, I have a sister, Antoinette, Antoinette mm -hmm. McPherson Martin who's a psychologist down here, and then I have a twin brother mm -hmm. who was smart and thin. <laughs> fraternal twin brother. And then a younger brother, Benjamin, who was a, a CPA down here. Mm -hmm. And I uh, went to Florida State University, the only time I've truly left the Florida Keys. Mm -hmm. And then I came back and um, I got married to Christina mm -hmm. Spatch. Christina's uh, family was actually stationed down here for an unusual amount of time, 14 years. He was a commander uh, pilot, and so uh, she uh, ended up uh, knowing my parents because my parents had originally started a church called Liberty Chapel, mm -hmm. and her parents went to that. But uh, Christina and Benjamin, uh, my younger brother, are the same age mm -hmm. and competed in high school. Really? You know, academically. <laughs> and so when I was uh, a senior in college, I met Christina make a long story short we fell in love and we just celebrated 19 years congratulations and I tell her the 10 best years of my life but she says eight and I'm just joking <laughs> and, uh, we have uh, four children mm -hmm. uh, Abby Gabby and not too shabby and no Morgan <laughs> David but that's Shiloh mm -hmm. um, Abigail Gabriella and um, Morgan mm -hmm. and little Morgan he's well all your children are beautiful but little Morgan he's got a lot of personality and character mm -hmm. he is He's neat. Um, uh -huh. you know, all of them are beautiful. Mm -hmm. My daughter, my oldest daughter, is uh, going into the high school, mm -hmm. and I believe that Jesus was coming back before she started dating. <laughs> so I'm a little <laughs> off on that one, but it is a scary <laughs> thought, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, I have a daughter that's going into the high school. Right, so. right. And now, Morgan, you served as mayor in Key West for, what was it, 2004? Uh, 2005. Okay. Um, I was mayor and three weeks later we were hit with Hurricane Wilma. Wow. So I like to say that it wasn't a baptism of fire but uh, a baptism of deep water. Mm -hmm. so, For real, right? <laughs> yeah, it was an incredible experience. Now what was your term like as mayor? I mean we have about a minute right now before we have to take a break but you know how much did you enjoy it? I did. I enjoyed it you know thoroughly. I learned so much. Mm -hmm. I mean there's so much to city government and there's so much to the municipal side of how um, you know, everyday life functions for all of us, mm -hmm. whether it's the city of Key West, the city of Marathon, or the village, or Monroe County. And so, anyways, I learned a lot in mm -hmm. that short four-year period, and mm -hmm. I'd like to apply that knowledge practically to represent you in the Florida House of Representatives. All right, and we're going to be talking about that. We have to take a break right now, but when we get back, Morgan will talk about your run for state representative for District 126 correct? 120. 120. <laughs> All right, everybody stay with us. I'll be back with Morgan McPherson after this. 